I can't believe I'm motherfucking walking at this school. I'm so embarrassed right now. Like. Uh. Just woke up. Or, you know, the last video I actually put makeup in my face and it was not 6 a.m. But, uh, you know, you win some, you lose some. I haven't decided if this is also gonna be a, like, what I eat in a day kind of vlog. I'm excited for you to, or to take you through my day. Also, I'm trying not to be super noisy because my other two roommates are not up yet. So that's why I'm, like, whispering. Okay, okay. But, you know, welcome to the vlog. So the clock is now like 10 minutes past 7, so I'm gonna go eat my breakfast. First meal of today, my protein oats, banana, peanut butter. Peanut butter and banana is life. You know, the usual. I'll see you guys at campus. I'm not gonna film a lot at the lectures because, you know, it can only be that amusing to watch a time lab of a lecture, but I'll bring you guys there, so. And then I'll try to face my sword out sort out my face a bit before we go so i don't look like actual shit when i go to lecture it's gonna be such a long day guys you have no idea <laughs> let me just show you an overview of today i have like an overview here on my computer i'll just show you but normally i also do like in hand to-do list but i know what i have to do for the morning so i'll just do that later long day today but let's get to I could just talk about this while I'm walking down to the metro or so. Yeah, in Denmark you don't live at campus. It's not like your university has anything to do with your living accommodations. So now for instance me, I live super close to campus. Denmark you don't, yeah, you don't live at uni. Um, your uni is campus and it's the place you go to lectures, you get work done, there's a library, there's still canteens and cafeteria, but it's not like you live there or anything like that. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know if you guys know more about the educational system and how it works and differs and everything I also talked about that in my how to get into CBS video which I can link down below yeah leave me a comment if you guys want to know more about that now there's gonna be a lot of people in a sec so I'll just put this camera down because walking in Denmark we talked about it before not a thing so everyone's staring at me so uh just see you guys later and I can't believe I'm motherfucking walking at this school. I'm so embarrassed, right? So we just had a lecture at one of the uh, other campuses. I showed you guys some clips. It's like super pretty wide hallways. Then this campus is like more so the main campus. It's called Sobia Plus. And right now we have like an hour and a half before the next lecture. And I'm just gonna go and utilize my time. Hey babe, walking at the school today. <laughs> This is one of uh, the main bays. Of uh, the Let's main do. bays? It's just... <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna head into the library now um, for the next hour or so and then head to the last lecture. They're like so quiet in there. So I can't walk in there or say anything, but I'll just like, film, you know? <laughs> can't believe I'm looking at the school. Jeez. second lecture of today and everyone's looking at me so I'm putting this camera down again <laughs> is this fine? how's the clarity? damn okay is the wind too loud? our professor was basically like I think I'm just gonna skip this because it seems like you don't get it so then everyone laughed and then he went back to the slides he was like I don't get how you can't get it and the model was just like 
you know it's like one type of lectures that we have at uni we can also have what is called exercise class and at that they kind of go through like exam relevant questions and case problems okay wait oh my god so noisy i am starving af um though i did have a yogurt at the school uh, that i bought in the canteen that's where we're at at the day oh yeah we talked about it this morning i live close to the school and campuses so right now i just dropped off at like one campus stop before where i live which is like the end station and the first four stops from my home is like all the campuses basically i just drop off one stop before so i can walk and talk to you guys now i live up here <laughs> On top of the mall now i have to go up all these stairs and i didn't want to do this talk walking up the stairs because i will be out of breath okay i'm up the stairs now what was i saying yeah you know the library you can't talk anything whatsoever which is also kind of why you know i'm going home to do my readings now so i can show you guys and tell you a bit about them normally like now like 1 30 i might head into the cafeteria and then head into the library again and do some readings but i also like to read at home so it really depends on exam periods i actually i go more to the library because i feel like it's more intense to sit there and study but otherwise i just go home and do my readings can you even see me in this light i have no idea so here's my lunch i just put it on the plate because i made all of this yesterday sweet potato mash and brussels sprouts some weird broccoli a quarter of avocado and then i made all these beans yesterday so these are actually white beans they look like this because i cooked them with these red beans they're looking all soggy but go eat this now it's a really big portion food is loving now food is babe and a lot of times i don't eat that interesting but this is looking at least a little more interesting oh yeah after like I said, pre-made the food. Sometimes if I need a bit of wheat, I'll just pre-make all the food. So here's the potato. Okay, I was literally still hungry, so I'm just having a second serving. And then I added some hummus here. So, yeah. Welcome back to the vlog, guys. Half past three. Um, I finished my lunch and then I just really needed to do something else than studying because I have been at uni five hours and then studying for the rest stuff from you know six till two just needed a little break and that's what i normally do when i get back home from the lectures of today it's like hitting the gym straight away because otherwise i'm just gonna die i'm already getting there i'm like fuck and it's not gonna be a long workout today because i still have a like shitload of work later when i get back home <clears throat> so i still haven't shown you guys like my actual calendar and reading list and i kind of want to take you through you know how I study for different courses, like how you can divide your notes and everything like that. Helpful tips or whatever, if you wanna take my tips. There are an extensive amount of people here looking at me, blocking, so yeah. I'll see you guys later, where I'm probably gonna be hungry AF again, so. Can you tell by my face I just went to the gym? <laughs> I wanted to show you guys what I forgot to show you this morning. This is basically how my calendar looks. I am an organizational freak in that matter. I really need to be time efficient with all the things that I want to do, but essentially, all the orange like squares here that is like the mandatory lectures we have at school not that you get accounted for coming and showing up it's not like high school so i had my international political economy lecture this morning and then i had international economics here so all of these blue like squares that is just me like making an overview of how much fucking reading i need to get done whatever it is and then i actually also plot in when i should film youtube videos then basically I'll just look up in the curriculum and then I will write um, down like what specific paragraphs and what specific pages so that I know exactly what to read. I'll kind of make an overview saying also like estimating how many pages that is so I know roughly how many hours I need to, to do that. I'm probably gonna read a bit more later. Actually didn't quite finish some of the readings for one of today's lectures. Also a thing like sometimes you don't know it until you've had the course and for me at least at my degree we have different courses at either quarter or like after um, a semester and you don't really know like what it takes um, from a course um, before you've had it for a while and I know how the reading readings looks in the different courses uh, that also really depends on what course it is like how I kind of divide my readings and workload I think I'll show you like how I approach notes actually video of 
doing uni stuff anyway, so I might as well show you, okay. Like I just said, it's really different how I read, but normally, so I color code my reading. When I read like some courses, I'll have to both do highlighting and take notes in hand and notes at the computer, whereas this course, I'll both like, when I sit here and read, I'll also, you know, because it's an economy course, I'll also draw graphs and more like graphical stuff um, in hand. Actually, I've never taken as many notes in hand uh, ever since, you know, you were like 10 years old as when I started uni. I take so many notes in hand, it's like ridiculous. I take notes during the lecture, from the readings to the lecture. I have no idea if you found that interesting or helpful whatsoever. If you guys want me to talk more about this, maybe leave a comment and I'll talk more about, you know, color coding, like uh, whatever. I don't know. I'm rambling. I'm really hungry. It is a full-time job for sure. Oh, I just had a few hours off, but otherwise I already was like doing study related stuff for like the first eight hours of today. Some days I would also sit now and read most of the night. When it comes to exam periods, oh my God. <laughs> I don't breathe. It's awful. Yeah. I'll see you guys later when I put food in my mouth. It's cheap, student budget, and it tastes good. And good macros. They're not that impressive, but I just made oats for dinner as well. <laughs> yeah, I don't have an excuse, okay? My lunch was fairly good, right? So I think I'm excused. Yeah, I'm talking to the camera. Okay. Much, much, much later. It's now 9 o'clock. I just is getting ready for tomorrow. Checking up on my classes tomorrow. So this is the only lecture that I have tomorrow. So tomorrow I know I'm gonna be reading a lot, for instance. You know, whereas today I had two lectures. I had like five hours of lecture. And tomorrow is gonna be the opposite. It's gonna be a lot of readings. Let me know like if you want to see that kind of video also. But you know, it's only so much fun to see me do time lapses of me working. So... so. Yeah, that's also what I've just been doing. I have finishing off this article for today. And again, I thought it was not hilarious to see me do another time lapse. I think it's been a pretty productive day today. Pretty accurate. Some days I work more, some days you work a little bit less, you know. In general, it is a full-time job and it is a shitload of work. At least the program I am studying. Yeah. I know this is, was a very different kind of video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And now I'm just gonna try and eat this uh, healthy ice cream. Very excited. Never tried it before, just saw it in the supermarkets. Oh, po. Mm. You can kind of tell how fucking tired I am, right? Yeah, now I'm just gonna chill the fuck out before I go to bed because I have to get up early again tomorrow. <sighs> I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Please let me know in a comment and Smash thumbs up button if you want more videos like this. Like comment down below if there's something in particular you want me to elaborate on or questions, I'll answer them all. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you enjoyed this video so you don't miss more videos of realistic days in the life. No, I'm just kidding. This channel is all about lifestyle. You know, university is only a part of my life, but uh, it takes up quite a bit of my life. But that's not normally what I film because I don't think it's very interesting to most people. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Uh, oh well. Um, I just keep rambling now, so I'm just gonna shut the fuck up and be like, hi. So yeah, see you guys. Peace out. Okay, before I end this video, I just had to tell you guys this. Ice cream is actually for the calories. It's really good, so definitely try it out. Opu, opu. Yeah, me and my ice cream. I just rented a movie. We're gonna chill now, have a great time.